Hi, let's jump into the scroll view component and working with objects. It is rare that all of the content of an app can fit on a single phone screen. You usually need multiple pages and have the option to scroll down the screen to see everything the app has to offer. The scroll view component gives you the ability to scroll through content that is not fit on the visible screen. One note, when using scroll view, all of the content is loaded at once. For our apps, that is totally okay because our apps aren't too big yet. But for more complex apps or projects where there's a lot of data to scroll through, there is a different component that will load the data as you scroll. In this example, we have a list of national park names and images. The problem is, they do not all fit in the phone screen and are clearly cut off. Each view has a text component and an image component, but we are limited by the scope of our phone screen size. This is where scroll view comes into play. First, we need to manually import scroll view at the top with the rest of the components. Remember to separate it with a comma like the rest. Next, we want to wrap all of the components we want to be able to scroll through with a scroll view component tag. In this case, we want to scroll through all of the components visible, but in the future, you might just want to scroll through a list of comments, images, or some other single part of the app. Let's add an opening scroll view component below the main view container, but before the contents of the app. And a closing scroll view tag at the bottom, after the contents of the app, but before the closing main view container component. When we run code, we are able to scroll through all of the content.